and here goes the storm and Lars is dead What's up Hero Wars? So this is me once again, Destiny Hero Akira, and this is Hero Wars with Coronavirus. And tonight, we're gonna cater one of the most exciting battle in the server, and this one is between DHA of Coronavirus against Jericho of Transcendent. And let's have a short analysis between both players' lineup. DHA got Astaroth, Park, Georgian, Lars, and Faceless. And Jericho got strong blender team of Astaroth, Envari, Kera, Sebastian, and Jet. Well, naturally, Envari is natural counter of Kark. And as you can see, the Kark's nest is of horror will knock up and stun enemies. And his deadly tendrils deals double damage. However, Envari's Living Earth skill protects allies from displacement and knock up effects. And oh, that's a huge counter against Kark. And to assess the counter by Envari, there are also rumors that Lars, Lords of Storm, skill is capable of moving Envari. But it is a good question if the current power or rank of Lars is capable of making it into the game a little longer. As you can see that Kara, Sebastian, and Jet would deal heavy damage with critical strikes. Now, who's gonna emerge victorious? Let's find out! And here we go as the fight between these two teams emerges. And we're playing this video at a quarter of the normal speed. And look at that. Lars is in trouble in this early stage of the fight. And there it goes. Lars is dead. However, thanks to its Astaroth, Lars is being to live a little more longer. And here goes the storm. And Lars is dead. So it's 4 against 5 now. And the Kark team is in trouble. Here goes Kark's ultimate. And look at that. Kira is in trouble. Here goes Faceless. It copies Kark's ultimate. And Anfari is being knocked up into the air for the first time in this fight. And here goes Kark. And there it goes. Anfari was being knocked up into the air twice in this fight and it's four against one now well i believe that the ha will be taking this one into the books it's four against one as you can see though the life of the kark team is a little bit low in this late stage of the fight however jet is not a good finisher for the late stage of the war and it's just a matter of time now before this thing will be in the books. And there it goes. And let's have a little fight recap. And looks like the Kark team is being the underdog in this fight. And Lars came to be the counter for Envari. However, it is really rare for us to see Envari being knocked up twice in the fight after Lars is being dead. And I hope that I will be showing you more exciting battles like this one only here on my channel. Goodbye!